So I don't know if I can take any more bad news. Apparently, bacon causes cancer. Aww. I'm Rebecca Felgate, and I'm talking about unhealthy foods and their effect on your long term health here on IO Today. First up, I want to hear from you guys. What food can you not live without? Can you imagine a life without bacon? Personally, I'm really, really struggling. Let me know in the comments below. The World Health Organization have officially declared that bacon and other such meat products are causes of cancer. Findings show that there is a direct correlation between red meat products and colorectal cancer. Okay, but does this mean that bacon causes cancer? The question on everyone's lips. What it does mean is that bacon and some other processed meats have been labeled as group one carcinogens. That is the same category as tobacco is eating bacon as bad for you as smoking. Surely it can't be. Well, the answer is not really. Whilst there's absolutely no doubt that the consumption of carcinogenics will increase your risk of cancer, smoking every day will increase your risk of getting cancer by 2,500%. Compare that with bacon. Eating two rashes of bacon a day is likely to increase your chances of getting cancer by 18%. So it's not quite the same. So there we have it. Eating bacon can certainly increase your risk of getting cancer cancer, but that said, if you eat it little and as a treat, then I think, you know, it can't be that bad. That's all I have time for here on IO. I'm Rebecca Felgate and I am pretty gutted about this bacon news. Let me know what you think in the comments below and be sure to like, share and subscribe. Until next time.